Toronto police say it happened around 1 a.m. near Markham Road and Lawrence Avenue East. Five men who had just finished their evening Ramadan prayers had been congregating in a parking lot outside Cedar Heights Plaza deciding where to get dinner. Our officers were informed that there had been a group of people shot at by someone driving by in a car. Toronto Police Media Relations Officer David Hopkinson says the car then took off northbound on Markham Road. Five men suffered gunshot wounds and were in hospital for serious injuries. They are expected to survive. Of the five victims, three of them were released from hospital yesterday. I believe two still remain. All of them between 28 to 35 years old are said to be family men. He says the hate crimes unit was notified, but it's too early to establish a motive. As a precaution, we talk to our, our hate crimes unit and they will provide resources to assist us in our investigation. That neighborhood has been troubled by gun and gang violence in the past. It is a designated priority neighborhood, which was going to see increased police patrols on a more permanent basis. The Imam of the Hamilton Mountain Mosque says he's worried and members of the Muslim community have also raised concerns. We're shocked and it's, it's, uh, it's quite alarming to see something like this happen, um, especially that uh, Ramadan is a peaceful month. We are in the process of getting in touch with uh, the Hamilton police chief. Uh, to see whether or not we can have some, uh, you know, uh, extended uh, or increased patrolling uh, around the, 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 the buildings of, uh, of all the local mosques. Syed Tora says he trusts that police will find the attackers and bring them to justice. But he also wants to see all levels of government increase security for places of worship. This comes after the head of a mosque in Mississauga alleges that a man who attacked worshippers last month yelled that he was there to, quote, kill terrorists. Witnesses say about 20 men tackled the man who wielded an axe in his hand and held him until police arrived. 24-year-old Mohammed Moaz Omar of Mississauga is facing several charges. Today we spoke to a brother of one of the victims from the drive-by shooting yesterday. He lives here in Hamilton and says his brother is recovering, but their family is traumatized. Manisa Danabalan, CHCH News.